yeah. we have recovered a bit yeah. and uh, we are pushing you know with that so it's a huge refinery uh, 650, is the largest single line in the world and uh, we have no infrastructure it's zero infrastructure so we have to build our own port to receive our equipment because 76% of the equipments we will not be able to receive them in Nigeria so we have to also build special roads from the seaside about 10 kilometers into the refinery mm -hmm. to be able to erect them you know there are so many challenges you know the soil was bad and we had to do about 120,000 piles up to 65 million uh, cubic meters of sand. So, but we've gone very, very far now. Our equipment have started arriving. We've commissioned the uh, small mini port, which we... Dangote Refinery is said to have provided over 250,000 jobs. And part of those workers include expatriates, 10% of them, which are white foreign international workers, 25,000 currently work in Dangote Refinery. And of course, are looking at homes around the vicissitude for their stay. Yes, Dangote Refinery has a, an estate for its workers, but still some workers are looking out for good investments around the area, that's a bedroom, lucky area, and good homes that they can also stay or even put some of their families while working at Dangote Refinery. So it's an excellent, excellent project, project area for investment. Let's listen to what more Dangote has to say about the refinery. So it's a massive uh, expansion. I mean, you look at the size of the land. The size of our land there is five times the Eco Atlantic. Five times million dollars the refinery the petrochemical the fertilizer and then lagos will really become an industrial hub because what we are investing if you add the entire uh, industries in nigeria they are not up to what we are putting up there so it's a must mm. during the marwa governor Saying the land is starting from this mark, yeah. that, that stone there. Normally, it's supposed to be from the road. Okay. Yeah. I am, I am. Eco tourist beach. As you say, it's opposite Lekki tourist beach. No, no, no. Opposite a good tourist beach. Okay. That is Lagos tourist beach. Oh, okay. And during the Marwa government. So this gate now leads to the beach. Yes, it's inside yes, the beach. The oh, okay. beach. That oh, is the beach very here. beautiful. Very yes. beautiful. Just say Nigeria, we don't know how to go. Yes, yes. And so that is the free trade zone, that building there. Mm -hmm. Building down there. Yes, this free trade zone, the building for free trade zone. What's this community, this place? This, um, this is tourist, eco tourist beach. Okay, it's part of the eco tourist beach. Yeah, it's part of the eco tourist Opposite eco tourist So, this, the beach is at the back. Nice. Okay. Okay, Akodo Police Station. Yes. Okay. Then, that rise is the police station also stand for this land. They are oh. security for us. Today. Good, yeah. good, good, yeah, good. And this road now is the way to, to Dangote Refinery, Seaport, and all. At the ending of this land. Okay. At, at the end of the boundary, yes, the, the next land, land is the Dangote Estate. Estate. Okay, okay, very good. Very good. Very yes. good.
Ending of this, I share boundary with Dangote. Yes, down, down. Eight hundred. Down, down. You go far. Down go far. Bagboro, bagboro. If they want to take you, eight hundred. So see what I'm saying. So see what I'm saying.